Well, two non-MPs are in the top decision-making body of the People's Action Party. At least one analyst says it's the first time in decades. The two are Labour Chief Mr Ng Chi Ming and Mr Victor Lai. They are among four more members co-opted into the committee today. Uh, Mr Ng was part of the team that lost in Sengkang GRC during the general election. The other non-MP is Mr Victor Lai, who lost in Aljunit GRC. We play a very important role to make, to make sure that the party is grounded, rooted, and that we serve a broad sweep of interests and people. One observer says the addition of Mr Ng is not surprising, and that's because the PAP and the Labour movement are exploring a closer relationship. You raise a lot of concerns uh, if the NTUC um, is not represented. Uh, and so Mr Ng, as the NTUC Secretary General, um, I think his co-option you know, signals that um, the party values the inputs of the Labour movement. Mr Victor Lai um, you know, was a losing candidate uh, in the 2015 and 2020 uh, general election. I see his co-option you know, as the party um, making that attempt uh, you know, for its highest policy-making body, uh, you know, to be better represented. Meanwhile, among the two others co-opted is Mr Edwin Tong, who is the Culture, Community and Youth Minister and Second Law Minister. He joins the Central Executive Committee for the first time. Another first-timer, Mr Alex Yam, has been an MP since 2011. If we look at the co-option of Mr. Edwin Tong, uh, I think it, it could suggest that um, you know, uh, Mr. Tong could be made for bigger things. Uh, since the 2020 general election, you know, he, he, he was promoted to a full minister. Uh, he was also recently appointed as uh, you know, the chairperson of the government uh, liaison group you know, with the Chinese uh, community. Uh, and now you know, uh, being co-opted into the uh, party's uh, central executive uh, committee. Um, so it, it, I think those are significant um, um, responsibilities. The remaining CAC, CEC members were previously announced over a week ago. A majority are 4G leaders. Those re-elected include Trade and Industry Minister Chang Chun-sing, Health Minister Gang Kim-yong and Deputy Prime Minister Heng Swee-kyet.